Well, today we are here at Hobo's Beach. It's uh, famous mostly for its surfing. And you can see a lot of people out here surfing this morning, including a bunch, a bunch of kids who are here in a lesson. And uh, here is the, here's the beach. A surfer coming up. There's a couple of restaurants here. Um, you go further on down. Not a lot of not a lot of shade. So we're at the, the east end. East end supposedly have some snorkeling here. Probably by by this this uh, feature here, which is called the wall. And uh, said uh, don't climb on it, but we'll probably climb on a little later because uh, we're not too smart. But uh, we're sort of settled in here for a nice relaxing day at the beach after yesterday. This is Hobo's Beach on a weekend. Lots of people, lots of music. Lots of people just hanging out in the water, doing the Puerto Rican thing of drinking their, their beverages in the water, just hanging out and talking. Uh, not too much waves here in this area, but you see it over in the distance. There's the waves over there, a lot of surfers, so they, they do consider it a surfer's beach. And uh, the beauty of this beach is we just walk up here is that there are multiple places you know to eat and drink cut through here a little bit and make like right off of the beach we have some places here restaurant here this one's still under construction, but, uh, but there's even several up here, and chop it off, there are some, some public uh, porta potties, which Lisa said were, were quite clean. So, uh, you know, it's a, uh, it's a nice place to come. Parking's a little limited, you know, on the street, come early. Uh, there's some signs for people who Say that you're gonna park there at their house for five hours. We haven't seen those yet, but uh, here's the beach, here's the view, and uh, it's a great place to, uh, to come and hang out. Mm -hmm. 